Doug Lyman says he's boycotting SXSW premiere of his Jake Gyllenhaal film Roadhouse to protest Amazon MGM bypassing theaters for prime streaming release. From his breakout in Swingers to The Born Identity, Mr. and Mrs. Smith, Edge of Tomorrow, American Made, and his upcoming film with Tom Cruise. They plan to shoot in outer space. Yeah. Doug Lehman's films have a kinetic energy. That made the director perfect for Roadhouse, an edgier version of the 1989 beloved B movie that starred Patrick Swayze, Kelly Lynch, Sam Elliott, and Ben Gazzara. Jake Gyllenhaal, who got back in similar chiseled mode he displayed in the boxing movie Southpaw, plays the bouncer who has never lost a fight. Lyman feels his movie, which has been selected as SXSW's opening night film, has been KO'd by Amazon MGM Studios with a prime video release, and he's not taking it lying down. In this guest column, he explains what happened, why he feels betrayed, and why this is a cautionary tale for a theatrical film business still recovering from the pandemic and the rise of streamers. But House opens the SXSW Film Festival, I won't be attending. The movie is fantastic. Maybe my best, and I'm sure it will bring the house down and possibly have the audience dancing in their seats during the end credits. But I will not be there. I've been to silently protest Amazon's decision to stream a movie so clearly made for the big screen. But Amazon is hurting way more than just me and my film. If I don't speak up about Amazon, who will? So here we go. When Amazon bought MGM, one of the few remaining studios making big commercial films for theatrical release, movies like Bond, Creed, they announced that they would put a billion dollars into theatrical motion pictures, releasing at least 12 a year. They touted it as the largest commitment to cinemas by an internet company. What they then did to me and my film Roadhouse, which is the opposite of what they promised when they took over MGM. The facts. I signed up to make a theatrical motion picture for MGM. Amazon bought MGM. Amazon said, make a great film, and we will see what happens. I made a great film. We made Roadhouse a smash hit. Amazon's words, not mine. BTW, Roadhouse tested higher than my biggest box office hit, Mr. and Mrs. Smith. It tested higher than Born Identity, which spawned four sequels. I'm told the press response has been Amazon's best since they bought MGM. Roadhouse tie-in to the UFC, which has a rabid and loyal fan base that has spawned over 1.5 billion social media impressions for the film, and marketing hasn't even started yet. The groundbreaking. And Jake Gyllenhaal gives a career-defining performance in a role he was born to play. Audiences will want to see UFC megastar Conor McGregor take his debut swing at Jake on the big screen. The reality is there's nothing quite so fun as a good bar fight. If we don't put tentpole movies in movie theaters, there won't be movie theaters in the future. Movies like Roadhouse, people actually want to see on the big screen, and it was made for the big